Federal agents have arrested former reality star Josh Duggar in his home state of Arkansas. Legal records show that on Thursday, April 29th, U.S. Marshals detained Josh, who previously starred on TLC's 19 Kids and Counting, and placed him in federal custody at the Washington County Detention Center in the city of Fayetteville around 1 p.m. No details about the circumstances of the 33-year-old's arrest have been released. No bail was set and the FBI had no immediate comment when reached by E! News. Neither Josh nor his wife, Anna Duggar, who recently announced she's pregnant with their seventh child, have commented on his arrest. Josh has faced legal trouble before but has never been charged with any crime. It is unclear if his past report cases are related to his recent arrest. In 2015, his extended family's TLC reality show 19 Kids and Counting was famously canceled after an unearthed, expunged police report from 2006 stated that the reality star was accused of molesting five underage girls when he was a teenager. The victims included four of his sisters, including Jill Duggar and Jessa Duggar. Their parents told Fox News that Josh, their eldest child, had admitted to inappropriately touching his sisters while they slept. He was never charged. This isn't something we wanted to come out, but if people can see that Josh, who did these very bad things when he was a young person, that God could forgive him for, for these terrible things, then I hope other people realize that God can forgive them and also make them a new creature. He later said in a statement he had acted inexcusably and said his parents arranged for me and those affected by my actions to receive counsel. He later resigned from his job at the Christian Lobbying Group Family Research Council. Following the scandal, Jill, Jessa, and many other extended family members, not including Josh, went on to star on a TLC spinoff series, Counting On. In November 2019, reports claimed that Homeland Security agents had raided Josh's office at an Arkansas car dealership in connection to a federal probe. He did not comment on the alleged incident. His extended family later denied reports that their own home was targeted by the feds, telling E! News in a statement, to the best of our knowledge, it is also not true that any member of our family is the target of any investigation of any kind.